time become death, the destroyer of worlds. And the Pathfinder was in that rite of union. Hello, Nexus. You're back. I am. Strux tells me you went to get the drive core from my remnant ship. That's true. And that you sold it to scavengers who took it off-world to make a profit. For you and them? It was gone when I got there. Not possible. I had blasting teams there day and night. Clan is a joke. The losers of Chichanka are now the losers of Helios. Overlord Morda has lost the Drive Corps, and our colony is doomed. You're all talk, Jorgal Strux. I made this colony. If there's an Overlord, they should be from the oldest Krogan blood, Clan Jorgal. Watch, I'll rescue the Drive Corps and make us so powerful that the Nexus will bow down to us. Except you can't, cause we have it. Fascinating tactic. What do you mean you have it? I'll let the Pathfinder answer that. I have it. But I took it from Strux's men, not the derelict. I'm impressed, Strux. You're more cunning than most Clan Jorgal. Smarter, even. Not more arrogance. My father lowered himself to join your clan because he admired your grandfather. He was laughed at, called not worth killing. But now I've bested you, Morda, and Clan Nakmore will pay with blood. You put the colony at risk over a grudge you carried across dark space? You really aren't worth killing, Dorgal Strux. Get out. Take your goons with you. Now where is the Drive core? Hand it over. Just like that? Hand it over? It's incredibly powerful. We'll use it to power the colony. This'll put us ahead by decades. Or old people in Helios working together. If you keep that drive core, it's over between the Krogan and the Nexus forever. You have to give us something for it. It's only right. We did get shot at. A lot. What about joining our colony with your outpost? Give us the drive core and we'll be friends. New Tachanka and Nexus. Keep it, and you've created a sovereign Krogan nation. We don't abide by Nexus laws or owe you anything. Even peace. Ryder, I must point out that historically, unchecked Krogan advancement has been the cause of war and disaster for many, even the Krogan. Well? Okay, Morda, let's work together. You can have the Remnant Drive Corps. And you can set up your outpost here, Nexus. We're all going to be friends and prosper, right? You bet we are. Whenever you're ready, bring your outpost people here, and they'll be welcome. This is a great day, Morda. We'll contact Addison and give her the news. Good luck, Overlord Morda. Pathfinder, this location is ideal for outpost placement. You can call an outpost via the beacon. Uh.
you about Araxia? Confirmed. Calling out. You really did it. Almost a civil war, and you brought them back. But it's all about the resources. No poetry, right? I considered the Krogan a permanent loss. Too many egos involved. Thankfully, my ledgers don't care how they get filled. If I can retroactively call the Krogan colony an outpost, that's a win. But that practicality is not universal. Tan will hate this. I'm not interested in opinions that don't see the value here. Good, because there will be a lot of them. But not from me. This is the last one, Pathfinder. The last golden failure we thought we'd lost. You did it. We can't rest for long, of course. There will always be a need. But for now, I need your voice to remind them what this meant. Get the flags waving. This seems more important than that. It's about setting a tone. Not telling the whole story. Thanks to the Krogan doing what Krogan do. Surviving, despite and in spite of everything. We have another home. It's not tame. It's not safe. But it's bringing the dream back. New to Chanka. One for the records, Pathfinder. Addison out. I've located a suitable site for an HNS receiver, Pathfinder. Nav point is hey, set. Hey, Nexus. Looking for that something special? Boomerang has got what you need. Best loot in the dunes, here for your perusal. You're a scavenger? Not anymore, I'm not. Fine folks at the initiative gave me a second shot. I'm on something called a probationary period, got a fancy metal bracelet on my ankle and everything. They're too good to old Boomerang. I'm keeping my eye on you. The second you put a toe out of line... On my best behavior, Pathfinder, honest. I'm a Nexus man now. If I scrap and scavenge, I do it for the good of the initiative. Reassuring. Enough about me. You're here for the good stuff. Look what Boomerang's got for you. I detect above normal temperatures. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. You tell him if we catch him there again, he's losing a hand. If you touch Karista Chana, Andromeda Initiative, here to oversee operations and attempt to repair relations between the Nexus and the Nakmor clan. It is a tremendous accomplishment, securing their cooperation. We can't afford to be divided. We need to work together to survive. I understand. 
and I promise to do everything I can to maintain relations. How's the situation here? Actually, I have a concern. There's a remnant architect in the area. You might have even seen it on your way in. If it detects us, or the Krogan, it's going to attack. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Ryder. In the meantime, I'll have our security on alert. If it comes down to a fight, we'll fight. I should get going. Be well, Pathfinder. Heat levels increasing. What is wrong with this thing? Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. I detect above normal temperatures. temperatures are within acceptable limits. Uh-oh. Kareest? Tell everyone to stay away from this area. Uh Whoa, hold it. Don't move. Okay. Got an irrigation system installed under your feet. It's still testy. Likes to give a nasty shock sometimes. Just make sure your footsteps around here are light. I assume you're studying agriculture. Sort of. I design agricultural machinery that performs best in arid landscapes. Really arid, in this case. Mostly I work with the botanists in the Krogan colony to give them what they need. I know Vorn. He's a good guy. Brilliant scientist, way ahead of his time. I'm just doing my best to keep up. Any other landmines I should be looking out for? For me, no. But I'd be careful about buying from Boomerang. He's a good guy, but a few screws short of the full ship, if you know what I mean. And we usually don't ask where he gets his wares. Noted. He once came back with a Solarian thumb. Said he thought it might be useful. See you around. Remember, light footsteps. you'd be my patient from the colony. She's 20 minutes late. The colony? Do the Krogan really need a doctor? Not for injuries. I'm a fertility specialist, Dr. Meshelanok. I'm working with the Krogan to maximize their new, more lenient birth restrictions. But I can't do anything if they don't show up for their appointments. Have you had any births in the colony yet? No luck so far, but it's early. Believe it or not, there's a deeply ingrained psychological pattern to colonization. Births won't happen till the Krogan feels secure. It's a biological reflex. I'm surprised you're working to help Krogan fertility. Why? Because I'm Solarian. I want the Krogan to thrive here just as much as they do. The initiative may not agree with me, but I'm doing whatever I can to lessen the genophage. Don't worry. I want the Krogan to make a life here just as much as you. I didn't mean any offense. Sorry, I'm so used to defending my stance, but I'm glad you agree. The Krogan have a real shot in Helios, better than they had back home. It's up to the initiative to help them along. I'll leave you to your work. Always so much to do. We need to get out of this heat zone. Improvement. Big improvement. 
You're the one who got the vault running, right? I have to say, when I heard about this place, I didn't think it would be viable. But now that I've seen what the vault's already done, I'm daring to hope. A few more years here, and you'll think of Elodin as home. I believe it. Sounds like the vault's made a big difference so far. That's an understatement. Since you activated the vault, I've observed the beginnings of cloud formations. Some of them are even nimbus clouds, rain-bearing. Months from now, we could see real rainfall. Rainy weather on Elodin. Can't even picture it. I can, and it's beautiful. What are you studying here? The evolving climate of Elodin and the possibility of water. There are already underground pockets, nasty brackish stuff, but it can be purified. My job is to see if it can someday reach the surface. Can you imagine? Rivers, maybe even lakes, on Elodin. That would be huge. Clouds, and soil that can hold water. That's all we need. Let's hope the vault provides. I should get going. Careful out there. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. <laughs> Environment check. Rider. Pathfinder, you have new email. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder.
You have AVP. Pathfinder, this site could support an initiative. Hot. Levels increasing. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals by your mining interface. That's the last of these news receivers. Let's go tell Davis. Don't let its size scare you!
after it.
interface, quickly! 